love me some chicken wings. I'm just telling you, especially with football season and the Super Bowl coming up. Here's how you make grilled wings that are really good, not deep fried, and yet they're still crunchy. And I'm gonna show you how to make a lemon sauce to put on them. You can put any kind you want, but this lemon sauce on the wings is really good. I'm just telling you, here's how you do it. First thing we're gonna do is get our wings ready. Now these are whole wings and you can cook them like that or if you want, you can cut them and separate them out like this. Find the joint and separate them. But I kind of like cooking them full like this. So that's how I'm gonna do it. We're gonna put all these in the bowl and then we are gonna coat them with olive oil, salt and pepper. And then we're gonna toss them to coat. Then we're gonna do that whole thing again. We wanna get all these wings coated with olive oil, salt and pepper, and that's gonna give us actually a little bit of a crunchy crust, if you will. Let's hit them again. Olive oil, salt, you can use kosher salt if you want, and lots of pepper. And that is it, my friends. That is all we need. Just wanna make sure, kinda of take a visual of it, make sure there's salt and pepper on each one. I think these are pretty good. All right, let's go grill them. Light your grill. Let it get up to around 400 degrees. All right, we're gonna put these puppies on. What I like to do when they're full like this is kind of stretch them out so that they cook a little bit more evenly. Okay, five minutes aside. Now you can eat these wings plain the way they are, or you can add any kind of sauce you want, a barbecue sauce, of course a teriyaki sauce, like we use on the baked wings. I'm gonna make a lemon sauce, which is a little strange, but it's really good, and I'll show you how to do it. We're gonna start with basically equal parts of lemon juice, cider vinegar, and olive oil. But if you wanna measure it out, do four spoonfuls of olive oil, and then apple cider vinegar, four spoonfuls of that, one, Four. Then the juice of half a lemon. And then we're gonna get a grater, cheese grater, and lightly grate the yellow parts off of this and put it in, it's called a lemon zest. And we wanna grate it just enough so we get some lemon parts, but not all the way through the white. And spin it around, get that kind of stuff. Tap that in. So the zest of a half of a lemon. This is where you get a lot, a lot of the lemon flavor from. Yeah, you can see it building up there. If you get any seeds in there, get those out. Last year, we're gonna add one spoonful of sugar and just a pinch of salt. All right, so we're basically making a vinaigrette and you can do that with a little bit of mustard or if you have allergy problems, which is kind of how I came up with this, you can actually use a spoonful of egg white instead. And we're gonna do that. So we're gonna get a spoonful of egg white. Lastly, we're gonna get our coffee frother, or we're gonna, you can use a little hand mixer or something, and we're gonna combine this together. There you go. There's our vinaigrette sauce. All right, five minutes is up. Flip these over. Of course, it depends a little bit on the heat of your grill. Five more minutes. All right, this smells great. We're gonna flip these over again. And we're gonna hit them with the sauce. That allows the sauce to caramelize a little bit, especially with like a barbecue sauce or something like that. So a nice rich sauce, we're gonna brush that on. We'll let that cook for one minute, flip them over, hit them with the sauce again. Flip them, hit them with the sauce again. When you caramelize these sauces, it kind of brings up the richness of the sauce flavor. Okay, that was one more minute. Let's take these guys off. You can push on them, make sure they're firm, make sure they're done. These guys look great. What's cool about grilling them is they actually get kind of a crispy edge on them. Mmm. All right, let's dump these in a bowl. Let's pour the sauce, let's, the remainder of our sauce, over the top. Make sure they're all coated. Dump them out in a the bowl. There you go. So that's how you make crispy grilled wings with lemon sauce. My name's Rob Barrett. You're watching Cooking for Dads. Cook well, it's worth it. Try these puppies out. Mm. 
Oh, it's so good. Mm -hmm.